It's a cloudy, overcast day in Bermuda. Just leaving the house. Got a busy day ahead. Got to head up to St. George's. Got to drop something off there at David Rose Jewelry. Also heading to Cold Snap Air Conditioning and HVAC Company. Got to drop a new switch in there for them and add a new computer to their domain. And I've got some more editing to do on the video that I'm working on for the Big Chill. Just stopping off briefly at the studio. Got to pick up some gear and one of the things I'm picking up is this switch for my customer. Got to just quickly check some email, make sure there's no messages and then pack up and head out the door. All right, just finishing up at Cold Snap and uh, getting ready to head up to St. George's. Thought you might like to see one of the craziest designed roundabouts probably in the world. Probably one of the most expensive roundabouts for its size in the world as well. Yep. We know how to spend money. into a little reggae. Yep, Island Tunes. Damn beat them. Now we're coming up to Flax Village. The famous pink buses of Bermuda. And the most giant speed bump in the world, where you pretty much need a four wheel drive vehicle to get over it. Giant speed bump number two coming right up. There's Adelio's new restaurant, Rustico, and Adelio himself. This is Flats and Latin. right up my butt so I figured I'd pull over and let it by. I don't think he was impressed. But hey. Yes, Bermuda really is this beautiful. We're still down here in Flats, Bermuda Aquarium and Zoo. This is the Flats Inlet. Call this the tea dock down here for obvious reasons. Many moons ago, I taught water skiing from here wakeboarding, kneeboarding, until I had my first child and I had to grow up, get a real job. Apparently, that's the thing you have to do. Well, here we go. There's worse places to be, for sure. This is one of the most beautiful spots on the face of the planet. Even though it's not the greatest weather, it's still absolutely amazing. Here's another staple of Bermuda for you. The Swizzle Inn. 
where the world-renowned Bermuda rum swizzles are made. This is very close to the airport, so what you do is you, uh, you swizzle in and then you swagger out. This is actually called Blue Hole Hill. Way back in the day, we had uh, a dolphin show over in here. And uh, used to have live dolphins performing there when I was a kid anyway. And this is Bermuda's Causeway. Which leads out to the airport. Which is over there in the distance. Fly in here and basically come in pretty low over these beautiful clear turquoise waters. And uh, some probably feel like they're going to be landing on the water that we come in so low. And then all of a sudden the land just appears underneath you and you, you touch down over here. But driving across this causeway in your taxi on your way to your hotel. How about that? Again, pretty flippin' amazing. Now mind you, when we do have hurricanes, even the ones that don't directly hit us, we can get pretty high wind that definitely churns up these waters. And that causeway can be a very dangerous place to traverse. And quite often, they close it down. There's the airport over there. Coming up to Ferry Reach, where we have our Bermuda Offshore Powerboat racing Sundays through the summer. sun's popping out through the clouds, giving you guys a better look at what this amazing country looks like just on an average day. This is it. Here we are, St. George's proper. The old town. do this again on a better day. St. Peter's Church. Famous, famous landmark. And now the challenge of finding parking. Well, there's one there, but I don't feel like parking there. Just saying. Here's David here walking down the street. I'm here to see you. Okay. I have one. This is unique. I know. It's kind of cool, eh? It's kind of like you. That's David, the owner of David Rose Jewelry. Morning, folks. How you doing? Just grabbing a little video. It is working. Are you Are you working? Yes, I am. I'm working too. Kind of, sorta. Ooh. These are nice. I have to look up who's who's the per, who's the person that designed those Bermuda swimsuits, the Bermuda ones, the one piece with the flag on the front. She was the one that actually designed them. Oh, okay, I'll have to look that up. <laughs> cool, thanks. How about that? Civilization begins with soap. Sure does. Some need more soap than others. All right, here we go. Uh. 
Oh, somebody's calling. Oh, it's Nikki. Back in a bit. Pop in the shop in Seattle. We're open. Good morning. This is called a this is called a camera. Oh, somebody call it again. It's your birthday today. Hey. Aren't you lovely? And what's up with you, Grumpy? Oh no! Woo! You're really grumpy.